Hi, another oracle deck that I've had for a really long time is Messages from Your Angels, What Your Angels Want You to Know from Doreen Virtue. Um, it's an actual, um, I've had this for a really long time. And these boxes really keep the card in good condition. This is 44 card deck and guidebook. Um, it's great for when you don't have a question. You kind of just want message from your angels, what your angels want you to know. Really lovely cards. I'll show you. Um, this is the hard box it, box it comes in. Comes with a great guidebook. Um, very simple guidebook. You turn to it, has a black and white picture, brief description of the card, and we'll go into an additional message for about a page. At the end, I'll pull a card so you can get the vibe of what the actual guidebook says. But um, actually, right on the card is a simple message, so you don't have to constantly go into the guidebook if you don't want to and just want a quick message. But I love these cards, and I'm kind of going back through my old decks and falling in love with them again. <laughs> Does that make sense? This is the back of the card. I really love it. Angel wings, the sun coming out, the earth. Really pretty. They're not gilded, um, and it's good card stock. They're always good card stock. So let me show you the images. So each one, it's a really lovely, sweet, gentle image, usually of an angel, and she names the angel up top, Francesca, and then on the bottom, it will have the message right there, so you don't have to go into the guidebook. What do you desire right now? Visualize it, and it will come about. Negativity will block your progress. Great advice, you know, just really sweet, loving messages to help guide you or remove blocks. Um, Astara, just really pretty. You deserve the best. Reach for the stars with your dreams and desires and don't compromise. Lovely. You know, things like that. Archangel Michael. Beautiful images. I'm with you, giving you the courage to make life changes that will help you work on your divine life purpose. Just beautiful. Archangel Raphael. See all these. Just really nice, sweet pictures. Got self-love. Ooh, here a new romance. You know, anything that the angels want to convey to you. Kasha, you are a spiritual teacher. You have the ability to counsel others and help them awaken their spiritual gifts and divine life mission. I, mean, I love the, all the angels in here. Archangel, this is Archangels. Just really lovely. Shanti. Rosetta. It's really lovely. Sweet, you know, and gentle. That's on the cover. Andrea, let's see what it says. You are a light worker. God needs you to shine your divine light in love. Live like an angel upon the earth and all of its inhabitants. That's what's on the cover of the Oracle deck. Really sweet, you know. At the end, I'll pull a card. Really soft, gentle, kind of like re-falling in love with these. I really like them. Patience. Caressa. And you know, like this, it's not all, you know, popcorn, happy balloons, or, you know, here, I mean, this says you're at the end of a cycle in your life. Call upon your angels to comfort you and to guide you to your next step. Happiness awaits you now. So, kind of like the death card, letting go, release. So, it's not all Pollyanna kind of stuff. You know, there are some, um, you know, darker cards, but in a nicer, soother way. Um, Serena, really like this, Ariel. New psychic and spiritual experiences are changing the way you view the world and yourself. Allow your spiritual gifts to open through study, prayer, and meditation. Athena, Crystal, Isaiah, it's really pretty. that. 
You are flying high right now, which may threaten others, but don't descend because others will soon become inspired by your example. I got this the other day. I really love these cards again. So again, this is the back of the cards. I'm going to pull a card for all of us who happen to catch this video and you can get your own little message today. Hold on a second. Let's see. Messages from your angels. Angels, what would you like? Ooh, okay. I knew they want to say something. This is the deck. It is Vanessa wants to say something. To make your decision, ask yourself which way brings me closer to my divine purpose. Which way takes me away from it? Wow. To make your decision, ask yourself, which way brings me closer to my divine purpose? That's a really, you know, see what I mean? They're like deeper. Okay, so let's see what the rest of the guidebook says about Vanessa. Let's see what you have to say, Vanessa. Vanessa, I'll just read it while you look at her. Because, um, Vanessa. Okay, so to make your decision, ask yourself, which way brings me closer to my divine purpose? Which way takes me away from it? Additional messages. Should I go this way or that way? You wonder. One day, you're sure of your decision. The next day, you question, question it again. This indecision will be healed by focusing on your divine life purpose. Even if you aren't sure of what your purpose is exact nature, you do know that it involves bringing peace to yourself and others. Based on this foundation, then, which decision brings you the most peace? If you're still unsure, then ask God and the angels to help you further. You can ask us which decision will help the most people. This is a wonderful basis upon which to make your choice. Sometimes the easiest route is the one that takes you further away from your divine purpose. So your indecision may come from a fear of making waves or uncertainty about your future. In such cases, gradual change is warranted. Slowly introduce your new direction into your daily life and ease out of your old direction slowly. In that way, you won't frighten yourself. You will be more open to hearing God's guidance and you will feel our love. Wow, what a wonderful message. See, there are deeper messages than you first think, you know? I really love this deck again. <laughs> so um, I'm almost glad I'm going through to make all these close-up reviews. Okay, so this is the back of the cards. Those, you got a taste of it. I was reading from the guidebook of the messages from your angels. What your angels want you to know. This is the box that it comes in. It's from Doreen Virtue. has 44 cards in it and in the guidebook and a beautiful angel on the cover of the box. And that has been my close-up review of this deck. And feel free to check out my channel for other close-up reviews. I'm putting a lot of tarot decks and oracle decks um, in the next week or so. I'm just going to throw them all on, on there in case anybody wants to check them out. Thanks so much. Take care. Bye-bye.